chase the moonlight. I work hard every day for a working man's pay, but I'm letting loose tonight. I think I'm gonna rise up. Welcome to Wyoming. This is the first leg of the Icon Tour of the Seasons this year, and we are excited to be in here. We've been talking about this trip for a long time, getting everything organized, ready to go, and the horses are getting loaded. We're ready to go. We got Land and Michaels, Gunworks Howdy. Extraordinaire. Let's see the rest of the guys here. They had to park for a lot farther away, I guess. See, we've got Lex. What do you want? What's up? Travis and Jimbo. What's up? What's your guys' word of advice? Oh, cleaning up the soup sandwich here. Yeah. And then we'll start walking. Helps you to keep track of your phone so we're not looking yeah. for that before we leave. 50 we're, miles today, we're right? Here, panic. Are you here to look? Is it in there? I don't think so, dude. I can't find <laughs> it. There's no dumb questions right now. <laughs> It's in the box of mountain houses. But we are excited to get in here. And uh, we've got, today's Thursday. Season opens on Sunday. And hopefully we'll go find some bucks in the next couple days. And we'll be ready. And we've got my dad. Hey. He's ready. The packer extraordinaire. Yep. So we're gonna get horses packed up and we're gonna hit the trail. Are we lost? I've been lost before. <laughs> Wouldn't be surprised. <laughs> mm. We made it to our base camp for the night. I say base camp for the night because this isn't where we want to stay, but we're afraid to go any farther without knowing if there's water or not. So it's a pretty nice little flat spot. And actually glass quite a bit of this country up around here. And uh, so we're just gonna set up the sawtooth, Kafaro sawtooth, not even unpack the wall tent and stuff yet. And just get set up camp for the night. Amazing country. What do you think, Jim? A lot of walking today, but made it up here. It's a pretty cool country, and uh, tomorrow we'll push on a little bit more and uh, set up our base camp and be ready to go. Start finding some bucks in the morning, hopefully. It's our first full day in here. We're just climbing up from our little camp from last night, and I spotted a bear up here. And Landon's got a bear tag, but. This one's got a cub, so no go on this one. But beautiful morning. It's gonna get warm today, it looks like, which is nice because we were totally expecting super cold weather. So the game plan for today is to find a better base camp, set up the wall tent, and do some exploring. So, but maybe shoot a bear too. 100 yards out of camp, and we've already got a pretty good four point sitting here. 
it's two days before the hunt so we're just kind of looking around getting the lay of the land and uh, doing a little scouting but that's a good sign we we've talked about going off all sorts of places but we've kind of joked that you probably do just as well hunting right out of camp and probably not far from the truth we ended up not moving camp had some guys go out and look for different spots and there was already camps up at the better spots for horses so we've got sheep herders tent set up everyone's kind of taking off and go scout for the night see what we can find come back have a good dinner hopefully find some good bucks tonight uh -huh. Trav and I took off two days before the season opens, so going to scout out a little ridge and a bowl that we've been looking at on the map for oh, a couple months now. So yeah. one thing else we found this morning is surplus people. A lot of folks. A lot of folks. Travis is beautiful, so. Landon and I just worked our way back into this one basin way over here and there's a stud black bear across the drawn. Landon's got a black bear tag but he didn't bring his rifle. It's like 417 yards. We got two other bucks spotted over here. Got some phone scope footage of them. Nothing amazing. But we haven't picked up a deer in this basin behind us. Picked up a few elk and that bear. So we're gonna glass here till about dark. We can look off both sides. We can see a ton of country right here. And uh, hope to find a shooter buck. Opening days, the day after tomorrow. So this is just beautiful country, though, like insane. Well, we're on our way back in. Successful, in some aspects. Checked out one spot, and it was not very good. And then uh, we did see some elk in there. We'll show you that. And then started headed back in. Turned up a couple more does couple little bucks and one okay buck so we'll come back in the morning and take a look see if Trav wants him I'll take him right now well, I mean, not right now yeah we can't do that right now <laughs> too early Welcome back to the Icon Tour. Thank you guys so much for watching. We've been really excited about this project and we're excited to launch it. Um, you guys just finished up the first video and uh, we've got 17 more videos for you guys. Um, this year we called the Icon Tour the seasons, meaning we hunted in Wyoming in September, Oregon and Idaho in October, and we finished up in Colorado in November. If you guys remember last year we started in Colorado and hunted four different states in 16 days. This year we wanted to change it up a little bit and kind of show you guys the diversity of the mule deer and the habitat that they live in. So we started off in Wyoming in the high country like you guys just saw we just got packed in there. Um, we'll be in the desert of Oregon, we'll be in the kind of like the river breaks of Idaho and we finish off in Colorado and uh, this project couldn't have been more amazing. Once again, we had some great partners that made this all possible. We really appreciate you guys watching it. If you haven't, tell a friend about it. We, uh, we really appreciate you guys telling friends about it and you know showing us the support that we really like. And uh, it's crazy, this is the first episode. We've got a lot more episodes for you guys. And we are giving away a Gunworks 6.5 PRC. So this year, um, I'll leave a link in the description below, but all you have to do is go on there in that click on that link enter your email there's some other options that you can do to enter in to win the rifle but the only mandatory thing is you have to just enter your email um but we're really excited to give that rifle away that's a gunwork 6.5 prc just like the one we were using this year it's got a gunworks climber stock it's got the the gunworks action proof barrel and the vortex viper pst gen 2 scope 
So we're really excited about that. We also, once again, are giving away gear on every video that we do. So today we are giving away a Kfaru Urban Zippy. So it's just an awesome little day pack, um, an everyday carrier pack. But we are giving that away today on today's video. We'll announce it on the third video. So all you have to do to get in there for that Kfaru Urban Zippy is leave a comment down below. Leave a comment down below, tell us what you think. And uh, that's, as, that's as easy. All you have to do is leave a comment down below. We are also have another contest that we just started this year. It's called the Screenshot Contest. So if you're watching this video on your phone, you can screenshot it and you can post that picture, that whatever picture, that screenshot that you posted. Post it to your Instagram story. Be sure to tag Switchback Outdoors and Switchback Screenshot. And we're gonna give away some awesome Switchback gear, whether it be hats or hoof of socks or, or gear from the sponsors. So that's pretty crazy. We were giving away three different items. We've got the Gunwork 6.5 PRC rifle, Click the link below, follow those instructions. Um, the car urban zippy today, leave a comment down below. Screenshot your favorite part of this video. Tag us on Instagram. You'll be entered to win some awesome gear from, from Switchback as well as some of our sponsors. So once again, I know that's a lot of information for you guys, but we are really excited about the Icon Tour of the Seasons. It's been an amazing project. We're looking forward to you guys watching and let us know down below your favorite parts, what you liked, what you didn't like, because we're gonna do something again next year. It's gonna be a little different, but it's gonna be very similar. So thank you guys once again so much for watching and uh, tune back in this Friday for the second episode of the Icon Tour of the Seasons.